Hi everybody, it's Thomas here from Thomas Fitzgerald Photography and in today's video I just want to take a quick look at something in the new version of Lightroom. So one of the key features in the December 2017 update to Lightroom is the new artificial intelligence based automatic function. So when I was uh, first heard about this, one of the things that kind of struck me was it's very similar to a feature in Luminar and that is the Accent AI filter. So I thought I would do a very quick comparison of the two versions and see how close they are and if it's comparable at all. So just to get uh, going here, I have um, this image in Lightroom. Um, it's nothing particularly fancy, but it's got kind of it's it does need some work, as you can see. Uh, it's very dark in some areas and then kind of slightly overexposed in others. And it's kind of one of those things that you play around with the sliders and stuff. And I know from experience that this is the kind of thing that works quite well in Luminar in the, for the Accent AI filter. So I just thought I would try and see the comparison of the two. So I have already set this up with... Um, I have just turned on upright on this just to fix this. So... Uh, and I have already sent this image to Luminar. So here we are in Luminar. Um, I haven't done anything to it here yet. So this is essentially the same thing unedited in both, apart from the upright. Okay, so just to know where we're starting off from. Okay, so let me just jump back over here to Lightroom and let me just hide this. All you do is click on the auto button. <laughs> and that is the results that you get straight away from the automatic in Lightroom. Um, so there you have it. <laughs> it's not much more to say to that. Um, it's actually pretty good for an automatic version. Um, I would add a bit more contrast to it personally. Um, but before I go and tweak that, let me just jump back over here to Luminar and see what its version does. So in Luminar, it's called Accent AI. So let me just hide all these other ones. So here it is here. And it's in this version, it works as a slider. So I'm just going to drag this up. So as you can see, it's giving us kind of a similar result. Um, it's not exactly the same. I'd say probably maybe somewhere around the 70% mark is probably kind of what we're getting in Lightroom. Um, so clearly there are differences here. Uh, this might be a bit over the top. Um, for example, I think it's a little overly saturated compared to the Lightroom version. Um, but they're definitely producing similar results. So let me just jump back to Lightroom again and just have a, another quick look in comparison. Yeah, so this, this the Lightroom version definitely lacks contrast. Um, so I would bump up the contrast a bit here. The one thing I've noticed with playing around with it is it does seem to err on the side of lower contrast for some reason. Um, not sure why. And I would probably bump up the saturation a bit. So... I'd say that's kind of edging more towards the Luminar version. That's probably a bit over the top as well. So anyway, there you have it. That's just a quick comparison of the two machine learning based automatic modes. Um, it is just a fun comparison. Uh, it's nothing too serious. And uh, I just thought it was interesting. So there you have it. And uh, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and we'll see you again next time. Thanks for watching.